This is the shortest podcast in the world about electric scooters. I'm your host, John. Let's ride. Electric scooters are a popular mode of transportation, and more and more people are considering buying or leasing one. There are pros and cons of both options, so let's dig in and see what they are. The biggest advantage of buying an electric scooter is that you own it outright. That means you can do whatever you want with it. You can modify it, sell it, give it away, do whatever you want, and you don't have to worry about monthly payments or mileage restrictions. Leasing an electric scooter can be a good option if you don't want to commit to buying one. With a lease, you'll make monthly payments and have a set mileage allowance. At the end of the lease term, you can either buy the scooter outright, return it, or lease a new one. So what's the best option for you? It really depends on your circumstances. If you're a college student and you're looking for something to get around on campus, leasing an electric scooter is a great idea. But if you plan to use an electric scooter as a primary mode of transportation, you're definitely going to want to buy one. If you plan on buying an electric scooter, head over to voromotors.com and use the promo code ADKELECTRIC to get $50 off your next electric scooter. Remember when riding to always wear a helmet, be courteous to pedestrians and cyclists, and most importantly, have fun.